If you struggle to get breakfast in because you're trying to get out the door, save this video. We're gonna be going to have a quick little meal prep that you can utilize for yourself and your family. You're gonna need a few items. Protein powder, some sort of fruit, blueberries is my go-to, some oats, and then an extra piece of fruit if you'd like. All right, this is a quick and easy meal that I'll utilize for myself. One thing I've talked about in terms of nutrition before is protein. Protein is very pro important, not only for fat loss, but also building muscle. In my 21 day challenge, I talk about getting at least one gram of protein per pound of desired body weight. So this is my go-to meal that I've had almost every single day. There have been some variations, so stay tuned for another video in terms of that, or, um, that meal exactly. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take half a cup of these oats. I'll typically take half a cup, put it in my bowl, then I'll take one cup of water, put it in there, then I'll microwave that for about a minute 40. Microwave might change depending on where you're at. Once that's done, then I'll take my half a cup of blueberries that I've measured out. These are frozen blueberries. I'll put that in my oatmeal and I'll typically push the blueberries down. So the frozen blueberries will allow you to let the oatmeal to cool off a little bit quicker. Another tip that I use is take a frozen ice cube. Obviously ice cubes are frozen. <laughs> put that in your oatmeal. <laughs> and then push it down. This allows it to cool down quicker so you can eat it faster. In the morning, I'm really pressed for time because I'm trying to get in and out either to the gym or to film or work projects or if I'm on the road, this takes me five minutes or less. So if you struggle with breakfast in the morning, this will be your go-to. So we have the oats, have the blueberries. Now you're gonna take your protein. You're gonna take one scoop of protein. This is the Live Momentous or Momentous Protein. It is a protein whey isolate. I'll take one scoop and I'll put it in there into my oatmeal. This has about 100 calories, but more importantly, if we're looking at the protein, we have 20 grams of protein. You guys will probably be able to see right from there, but 20 grams of protein per scoop. This is a chocolate favor. People might be like, ooh, blueberries and chocolate, it actually tastes really good. Um, so you're gonna mix this up. So I've mentioned before in previous videos, specifically in terms of nutrition and macronutrients, you wanna get one gram of protein per pound of desired body weight. Like I've mentioned in my fat loss challenge, that has been a big focus and that will continue to be a big focus for people that are looking to lose fat and build muscle. If you guys wanna check out that challenge, feel free to check out the link below. It is 21 days of lessons, meal plans, daily workouts, daily uh, challenges, which would be great. It's gonna help not only help you with fat loss, but also build sustainable habits and make better decisions for your body. All right, so once that's mixed in, we have the protein, the blueberries, and then also we have the oats. Then next I'll take my blueberry, my blueberry, my banana, and depending on the day it is, I'll eat either with a full banana or I'll put half. Now this is not gonna be super technical in terms of how I cut it, but I'm lazy sometimes, but I'm also being efficient on what I have to clean up. So I'll just take a bite and bite my banana into my oatmeal. Again, if I do half a, half a banana, I'll just eat the other half or I'll put the rest in here. Again, I'm saving on cleaning up. Also a time efficient uh, habit to have. All right, so then from there, we are going to mix this in. And we have our to-go breakfast. Now, if you like your oatmeal a little bit maybe thicker, you can do a little bit less water. If you want it more running like a soup maybe, put more water in there. But you are getting your protein. You are getting carbohydrates, right? You're getting a little bit of fat, like three grams of fat. In, in this specific oats, right? Rolled oats from the Red Mill. Um, you're getting lots of carbs, lots of protein, a little bit of fat. If you need additional fat into your macros, then you could add a teaspoon or two teaspoons of almond butter, peanut butter, any other, maybe nut butter. I know sunflower butter is an all, another option. But again, when I recommend with clients or when I recommend individuals that are following the 21 day challenge is about getting one gram of protein per pound of desired body weight. And along those parameters, 20 to 30 grams per meal. Now, carbohydrates are very important. I've talked about this also in my 21 day challenge a little after the first week. Carbohydrates are very important to paint on the type of training. If you are doing a lot of high intensity, a lot of CrossFit training, carbohydrates are important. And when I break down my macronutrients, I do a 40-30-30 split, meaning 40% of my calories are coming from carbs, 30% of my calories are coming from protein, and 30% of my calories are coming from fat. Now, depending on where you're at and what your training goals, that might change. If you're not doing a lot of high intensity and you're not doing a lot of training, and maybe you're just walking, you're doing long, chill cardio in terms of like walking, maybe some running, you could probably cut back on the amount of carbs. Everyone's different. I'm giving this to you guys as a guide. If you want this exact macro breakdown, I'm gonna have it in the comments below that you guys can utilize for your nutrition. If you guys enjoyed 
more macro friendly meals like this or quick and easy meals, feel free to share this video with others and also leave me a comment. I have this almost every single morning. Like I said, stay tuned for a separate video that I will talk about in terms of another easy meal that again, takes five minutes or less. If you guys found this beneficial, please share with others. And if you want more meal prep videos, also let me know.